What's up, me pirates, buccaneers, lads, and seamen of the world? <laughs> and welcome back to Atlas. And last episode, we built this amazing ship, the SS Never Sinks. And we're going to continue to voyage out to, um... I don't know, somewhere. Like, uh, there's a island, like... There's an island a bit to the north, and we're going to try and go there. We're going to see what's there. So, uh, yeah, let's get on with it. Raise the sails. The ship is pretty fast. I will give it, like, the ship is incredibly fast. Oh, yes, the music. Now, I hope you get the deal with some pirate ships, because I never really test float, tested this ship. Oh, hold on. Adventure can wait. I think we might be able to actually do a battle. Hold on. There's a shipwreck over here. When there's a shipwreck, there's banished uh, vessels. Not the Halo banished, the, um... Wait, wait. Oh, no, ships of the damned. That's their fault. They're, they're basically like ghost ships. It's, like, really cool. And, uh, you can, you can, like, kill them and get decent, like, you can get decent crew members and kill them, so... Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Let's hope we find some. They're normally nearby shipwrecks. They normally just spawn in random locations, but mostly just near you, just so you have things to, like, keep you busy while you're out in the open ocean. Okay, so we arrive, so we're, like, here. I don't see any ships damned. That kind of sucks. See, it's sinking treasure quality is not good anyway, so. I don't know. But oh, we're entering the new uh, sector, because um, how this works is, um, yeah, how this works is there is, um, there's different sections to the map, just to kind of keep it so, you know, the game doesn't crash. It loads in different parts of the map. Because this map is huge. Like, it really is. It's massive. Alright, we're entering a new sector. Oh. Alright, we're here. And I can already see the island right there. We're gonna try and get it, actually, so... Okay. Alright, we're getting pretty close now. Well, by pretty close, I mean we're about... I'd say about a couple hundred feet away. I'd say. Okay, yeah, there's definitely a curse of the damn ships around here, I can already tell. Come on, show yourselves. Really? Oh, come on. Cowards. Is there a way I can collect the loot of my ship? Well, let's see that real quick. If I run it over... Oh, no, I think I just break it. Okay, I don't think, uh... Actually, let me go down to the, um... Hold on, let me go down to our resource box and see if we collect anything. Oh, wait, we... I think we did collect something. Yeah, we did. Oh, that's cool. So we could just run, uh, run things over and we collect them. Oh, that's pretty cool. I did not know you could do that. Okay, we're approaching the island now.
Alright, now I think there are pirate camps here, so I think we're gonna have to, um... We're gonna have to actually defend ourselves, because when there's pirate camps, there's pirate ships we have to deal with. Which means combat! Finally I get to test out the SS Never Sinks in action. Alright. Oh, I see something right there. Keep uh, getting at. It. Let's keep going at a decent speed. I want to see what that is. I don't have a spy. But actually, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna. S okay. GFI spy blast one zero zero. There we go. It's definitely a structure. Don't know why. Okay. Hold on. There's um too much land over here. We we'll have to go around. Come on. We still got some. We still got the wind on our side. There we go. That is though. It's definitely an ancient structure, but I don't know what it is. Hopefully, it's not Aztec. I don't want to get cursed. Shout out to the people who know what I'm talking about. So, pretty sure everyone knows what I'm talking about. It's Pirates of the Caribbean. If you don't know, it's Pirates of the Caribbean. Oh, and we beached. All right, great. I mean, the ship's called Never Sinks, not Never Beaches itself. That's that's not the name of the ship. There we go. And wind, take us away. This thing is so freaking fast. I think it's ridiculous how fast it's now. Beach again. Thank you. Okay, yeah, we're in some pretty dangerous territory right here. I'm gonna take us a bit farther out. That's not good. Okay. I think we're in the clear now. I have no idea, though. Oop! Well... If that was a misfire, I don't know what is. Alright. Okay, so we can kind of just hang out on, like, the edge of the island, but we can't exactly interact with anything. Did they change this map? I swear there's actual, like, people you can fight here. I might be thinking of a different map, then. Uh, yeah, I might be thinking of a different island. Alright, is there any place where we can get the ship in close? Oh, we can. Once we head to the opposite side of the island, we can get in pretty close. To the main part of the island, that is. Just a little bit. Come on. What is that? Ah! It's a neutral structure. Okay, I was wondering what that was. Neutral structures, I think they belong to ships of the damned, and they kind of... They're kind of powerful, so we can't really go for them. And also, you can't take them out, which is weird. Like, for some reason, you can't actually, like... They just respawn back in. I think they only work in live servers, which, which is kind of weird. This game, it was definitely made for servers. 
Like, it was definitely made for just, like, servers alone. You can tell. Because most of the game's features belong on, like, non-dedicated servers and just regular servers. Which sucks, so... Oh, that's what that is. I have to deal with a bit of high um, high water. Alright. Okay, yep. Let's do a little bit of a kind of a U-turn. Oh, this might be a bit risky. Okay. We're good. We're good. We're good. Kind of going against the wind, but... Gives a bit more time. Alright, once we go landfall, I think we'll make it to the island that's a bit up there. Like, that's more north, because I know that one will definitely have some pirate bays. Okay, I think now we can uh, do this. There we go. There's one. Wait, hold on. We can always just do this. and I'm going to go more in land. Never mind, it's not going to keep firing. Huh. Okay, yeah, we're taking care of some structures. Oh, there's a nice pyre right there. Okay, it's somewhere right... Oh, wait, there it is. I think that's it. Yep. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, there's another heavy pirate, like, right there. Okay, hold on, what? I think it might be better if we just do something like this. Full Sabo! 
This might actually take out the trees as well, which will kind of give us a bit more of a sight advantage. There we go. Alright, now real quick. Take out that tree. There we go. Now take out those trees. Keep firing. go in now and just assess the damage. Wait, before we do that, extend the ladder. There we go. Alright, let's go. Get my sword out. Let's go. I don't have a rifle, so I can't just, like, snipe people from far away I kind of have to make do with the sword, so that'll be fun. Now 
that's just the ballistic I left. Oh, you gotta be serious. Wow. everyone? Wait, who's left? Oh, right. We have conquered the Killing Isles. The day is ours. Can't believe we actually did this, honestly. <laughs> All by ourselves as well. We've done it, everybody. Let's head back to our ship. Raise the sails. On to the next island. Now I believe we just gotta head north, and that's pretty much it. Let's get back to the open ocean. We've conquered the Killing Isles. We massacred. Pirates. Even though we ourselves are pirates. But we don't care. We conquer. My pirate actions get worse and worse. Like, first it was Norwegian, now it's like. I don't know. Like. British? I sound like, it, I sound like an Imperial officer <laughs> from Star Wars. But anyway. If you got and if everyone enjoyed this episode, be sure to slash that like button and boom with your sword and blow it up with your flintlock. And I will see you guys next episode. See you guys then.